anything else that people feel good at at this point after self-assessing their jobs? Okay. Yes, William, please. Well, linking your real life situations to uh, more <coughs> questions. Okay. Yes, absolutely. Okay. I, I have a question about the real life situation. Yes. Can they be purely hypothetical? So, or do you have to give like something like, for example, when you talk about emotion, can you just say, for example, a guy and a girl fall in love and this shows uh, You can do that. Or do you have to like literally give an example of something that has to happen? It depends on how you run your argument, okay? Anything goes. Um, yeah, as shit. Yeah, 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 yeah. They won't check anyway. What, what was that? They won't check anyway. Oh, Victor, please, you're such a class pessimist. Okay, um, all right, now, people, this is really, really good, okay, what you came up with the strengths. Now, before I go on to answer some of your general questions after doing this, what are the weaknesses that you see? of ideas. Writing it, why? Organization of Organization, ideas. okay, good. I did see that in some of the drafts. The organization is a challenge, yes. What else? Shook. Being descriptive. Being descriptive, okay, good. And I see another hand, hang on. Yes, Sean? Writing in a clear manner. Writing in what? Clear. Clearly, okay. R discussing the, the, the TOK application clearly, is that what you're trying to say? Okay, discussing TOK skill application clearly, good. And one more I'll take. Victor. Not being biased. Okay. So y y it's hard not to be biased. And William. No, I said uh, it's hard to avoid writing in wordiness. So instead of going straight to the point, then. Hard to write concisely. Yes. I saw that also. Okay. And Victor thinks that. Um, it's hard to write neutrally on these questions, yeah, okay? Hard. It says, how, what do you agree? Uh, to what extent do you agree, but you also need to show the other side. So, so this is what I saw. I saw all these points, okay? And if this is you, okay, if you are struggling with organization or discussing TOK application clearly, uh, um, th that is to be expected. This stuff is really hard. Okay, you have to think of it in this way. They give you a prescribed title. You have to unpack the title. Unpacking the title means decoding what they want you to be doing. Okay, then what you have to be doing is structuring your response based on the unpacking of the title you did. And you have to demonstrate that you are thinking about TOK questions and you are applying it to the real world. Now, remember when we were doing the presentation, it was the other way around. You were taking a knowledge issue, and then you were uh, forming our knowledge claim. The terms are always changing. Then you were changing into a question to be further explored, okay? To deepen your knowledge of something and to widen your perspective of something. So you're taking a real life situation in the real world and applying it in the theoretical world of TOK. Now, you're taking this, a, 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 you're giving the flip side of that. You're taking a, a TOK question and you're trying to apply it to the real world. But for now, I thought the easiest thing would do would be to work with a paper copy. Okay, so on Manage Back, there is this copy of this essay, but the only way to write notes about the structure is actually by hand. I could not make it work. I did not have time to edit the PDF copy so it's fillable on the ManageBacks um, platform for us to work with. The first thing I want you to do is label the paragraphs. Okay, in this essay, it just makes it easier to refer to paragraph one, paragraph two, paragraph three. So the way I want you to do this is this. Okay, with the first paragraph, if you wrote down just P1 by it, like that, okay, like the example I just wrote, that would make it easier to refer to. If I say, okay, um, how is the um, question unpacked in P1? Can I something? No. Are you sure? Yeah. Okay, that's your choice, but I'm here to help you, just so you know. Okay, do my comments make sense to you? 
You know, he, uh, Do you want me to go over it? I wasn't sitting there. Just give me copy paste and stuff. Did you look at both my documents I sent you? Yeah. Yeah. Well, I sent you two documents. You sent me. No. You s resend me to my draft. Yes, and, and then I sent you a document called yes, Victor. Yes. Yes. Okay. So. I just wanted you to get the terms right because I thought it might produce more knowledge in terms of what you were arguing. That's what I did for. Mm -hmm. uh, that's why I did. Sorry. Um, do you agree with these definitions? No, this one is wrong. Okay. Yeah. Well, then write about it. No, because when I did it, you said I shouldn't. No, I didn't say that. I said in that the first one it, I had. It needed to be more focused. No, in the first one I had, you said not to use it. Shall I? Does this make sense yeah. to you? Is it helpful? Like when we worked on the extended essay, remember we corrected that copy? Yeah. I think that helped you a lot. I think mm -hmm. that's why you did so well in the end. I really think so. That was one of the reasons. Mm -hmm. Do you, would you not agree with that? No, no. I, I, th I, I love that session where I gave you. I thought we got a lot done, and I thought that you really understood it too. Yeah, it definitely. Yeah. Okay. It helps me a lot. So this is okay. Mm -hmm. Good. Really good. Thank good. you. Excellent. Thank you. Yeah? Is it giving you, uh, is it making you, that, yeah, yeah, it's for you. It's you have example. lots of great ideas that you do. You just need to, like, focus in one direction. Yeah. Yeah? Nice. Okay, good. Excellent. We can, uh, what I'd like to do tomorrow is, okay, finish doing this tonight, so if you haven't got it done, and tomorrow we'll just go through this again at the beginning of class. And then um, we can see if you want more work on this example or not, and decide what, what to do next with the uh, continuation of the draft writing process. Okay? All right. I mean, it's the sight, it's the hearing, it's the smell, it's the reaction of touch. I mean, that's something to focus on just in the, the W okay of sense perception. Even if you focus on two out of five and argue your points, that would be enough. That's perception also perspective of somebody that comes to our way. Yes. Okay, good. All right. Um, according to my clock, the time is up. Okay? Oh, no. So, you have one, two more minutes actually officially by my computer.